About a year and a half ago, I published a video showing how to remove the impeller from this thickness planer. And the reasons for removing the impeller are that it reduces the amount of power that goes towards chip extraction and cooling the motor. The four inch hose and a dust collection system will handle that for you. And instead allows that power to go towards the actual cutter head. So you get fewer breaker trips when you're planing wider boards or taking deeper cuts. I've been doing it this way for about a year and a half and haven't had any problems. And today somebody posted a comment on that video saying that there is a third purpose for the impeller. And that is to break wider chips into smaller pieces if you're using the stock knives. That's beneficial because it uh, reduces the likelihood of your dust collection system getting clogged up by long shavings. Well, I hadn't thought of that before and it kind of makes sense, but I wasn't entirely sure if the impeller actually does that. There's only one way to find out and I conveniently have the stock knives in my planer at the moment because I'm working on another video. I only have about 10 projects going on right now that I would kind of like to finish, but this was pretty interesting. So how about you join me and we can go chase this squirrel. We will start with the impeller out because it already is. There's the impeller and you can also tell by the sound. And we will be feeding it this lovely piece of ambrosia maple. I will feed the cracked end in first just for consistency with both passes. I'll maybe do about uh, three runs with this and then three runs with the impeller in and we will compare the sawdust. And my dust collection system is empty. That's a lot more than I thought. I should have done one pass. That's the outside, that's the inside. And I think that's a half inch. All right. I know that was a mean trick, but it was funny. All right, now notice a different sound with the impeller in. <laughs> I gotta plug it back in. I did unplug it before I started. All right, now the different sound. All right, let's do three more.
Yes, I forgot to turn on the dust collection system, so let's do that one again. Take two. This guy out of the way. Well, and there you have it. That is with the impeller removed, and that is with the impeller installed. I would say that there are definitely smaller chips with the impeller installed. So that question is answered, and thank you to my awesome viewers for keeping this channel interesting. Have a great day, and thanks for watching. Speaking of squirrels,